Thomas was still looking for Fergus and Rusty. Just then, Duncan came up. I, I have Rusty, said Duncan. I'm not in the Diesel Alliance anymore. Yeah, said Rusty. You should have seen it. Duncan pushed Smudger right off the end of the incline. It was amazing. Great, said Thomas. Let's go find Fergus and get back our railway. Meanwhile, Fergus brought a car to the docks. He was expecting Salty would be there for the car for his train. Father Salty for not showing up for his train, said Fergus. He had no clue that the Diesels took over the island. Well, I might as well just leave this here and get back to my work so everything is on time, he said. Fergus then uncoupled to the car and puffed away to his work. Just then, B.T. Boomer came out of Sir Topham Hatt's office. He was looking very suspicious. Just then, Thomas, Alfie, Duncan, and Rusty came into the Nafford station where P.T. Boomer was. Stop right there, Boomer, said Thomas. What were you doing in Sir Topham Hatt's office? Oh dear, said P.T. Boomer. You'll never catch me, said Boomer. Boomer then jumped aboard Bulgy, and Bulgy raced away. I wouldn't worry too much about Boomer, said Thomas. With Bulgy going that fast, he'll crash off the road any minute now. Fergus was going to go to his work, but then there was trouble in front of him on the track. The big city engine and Spencer raced around the corner in front of Fergus on the track. Well, 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 look who it is. It's the stupid Fergus. Big city engine, said Fergus. What are you doing? Just then, the big city engine got right in front of Fergus. I've been waiting for this for a long time, said the big city engine. Just then, the drawbridge rose up. Just then, the big city engine pushed Fergus close to the edge of the drawbridge. Wait, said Fergus, before you make this choice. I just want to say that the first day that you came on Sodor, you were instructed to work in the yard with me. I tried to get you to do the right thing, but you wouldn't listen. Please, whatever you do, listen to me now, and don't do this. Get away from the Diesel Alliance. Come back on Sodor. Please, the Diesel Alliance is no good for you. Please come back. The big city engine sat there for a good ten seconds, thinking long and hard of what Fergus had just said. And then, before anything, the big city engine whispered the word, one word to Fergus. Never. The big city engine then pushed as hard as he can Fergus into the water. Fergus then was in the water and drifted out to sea.